welcome to my channel i hope you guys have had a phenomenal week and that you've been crushing your training um i wanted to have a conversation with you guys about some of my aspirations for 2020 so uh you guys have seen me do a free diving competition you've seen me do my deepest depth you've seen me do okay you didn't see my longest dynamic but i thought i would share with you guys where my head is at uh, with regard to training so i've realized that with regard to depth training i think i've been approaching it the wrong way one i'm considering getting a coach and two i want to change up um how i've been training thus far so if it works out i'll definitely let you guys know about it um, but anyway so from a static perspective my dry static my longest dry static was three minutes 31 seconds i'm wanting to move that up to about four minutes 30 seconds uh in 2020 and i really want to think about how i want to do this because um i'm still doing my co2 training i'm still doing my um pranayamas i'm still doing my apnea walks so i want to see how i can work around that and my general breath holds obviously so at the end of the week sometimes i might just hold my breath for as long as i can so i want to structure that a little bit more um, the more structured it is i think the more you're able to see results because if over a three month period i'm doing it a particular way and i'm not seeing good and i'm not seeing um, good results then i can change it up so I really want to do more structured training from that regard. From a wet, wet static perspective, my current wet static uh, PB is 2 minutes 48 seconds. I want to take that up to like 3 minutes 45. I don't know. I, I don't know. I really want to take it up. I want to see if I can do it. And um, I actually have a video that's coming up where I'm holding my breath at one meters and I'm holding my breath at three and a half meters and just to see the difference because it's just good fun um, but yeah so that's where I'm at with that I'm excited for the my static journey just because it just talks to more of my relaxation you know getting out of my head and just yeah I'm excited about that uh, and with regard to my dynamic I want to go conservative and say something like a hundred meters my current dynamic pb with using bifins is 80 meters 80 meters kids i did 80 meters so i'm excited i want to get to 100 meters i want to get myself a monofin um so i'm just saving up towards it and as soon as i can then i'm going to get myself one and we can push past the 100 but i love the idea of just swimming all the way down of 50 meter pool turning around and swimming all the way back and just coming out of the water and giving out you know taking off your mask and giving a beautiful okay that's what i'm excited for um and to be able to do a third lap would be phenomenal like that'll be amazing um so that's where i am with my dynamics um as you guys know i'm still trying to practice how to do the dynamic no fin bit um yeah that's properly kicking my ass so <laughs> um so i'm still working at it so i don't really have any um i don't have any i don't have any aspirations linked to dynamic no offense probably if anything learning how to do it properly that would be fantastic um and then lastly my depth so again like i said to you guys i'm changing up my depth training a little bit and i would like to give you an update in about march to tell you if it's working because then we would have had three months to look into it and see how it's working my current personal best for depth using um, so constant weight by fins is 26 meters so my deepest is 26 meters and what i would like to do by the end of 2020 is 40 meters i don't think it's a massive um groundbreaking goal but there's something that's attached to that and i really want to see it through and again i'm at 26 now let's have a look in march right let's see how i'm doing in march if the change in training is actually working and if or if we need to look at something else but either way i'm looking to get a coach and we can work around that so from a free immersion perspective i really am i would like to get to just 30 meters just taking one step at a time one step at a time all the way to the bottom and just 
slowing it down so essentially i am working on slowing it down but as well what i realized i was watching one of the other free divers and she comes down quite quickly and i often take it slow so my swim down is always slow so i want to work on slowing down the whole process but moving my legs a little bit faster because like in a minute she will do 30 meters and in a minute i'll do like 20 25 meters so that just tells me that there's room for me to maybe make my stroke a little bit smaller instead of wider i think i might be trying to go wide make it smaller but quicker and see where that takes me so guys that sums up my aspirations for 2020 i hope you guys will be with me through this journey i'm excited to see it through and yes and i think i might even start competing in the new year so well officially competing anyway guys thank you so much for watching please do drop me a comment below let me know what your aspirations are with regard to free diving in 2020 um and i'm excited let's do this together anyway thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like the video and have a phenomenal week cheers <laughs>